Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Hello and welcome. We have to be honest, it's not a very pleasant night for football. The rain has been coming down heavily in advance of this game. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England defender, Lee Dixon. And on the menu is live coverage from Liga NOS. It's Porto up against Benfica. Thank you, Derek. Just flicking through my notes at this one, everything pointing to a really lively matchup. This is fingers crossed, eh? Well, here's the starting 11 for Porto. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. A preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. And a chance for them to notch in front. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Well, he's given a corner, they referee. Over it comes. Well, punch happy, the keeper. Grimaldo. Will he finish? Goalkeeping of the very highest order. Oh, it was a great shot as well. Great shot, great save. Going short. He'll be cross with himself based on the position he had taken up. Well, yeah, it was poor technique, wasn't it? Thrashed at it a little bit, went for power. Well, he's disappointed with the fact they haven't taken the lead, but he'd be pleased with the way they're playing. Sergio Oliveira. Zé Luis. Suarez. Looks promising, this. Textbook defending inside the box. Well, it's tight at the top and extremely tense, just as we would want it, Lee. Well, still a way to go. Second half of the season is going to be pivotal. Who's going to be brave? Who's going to be the one that pushes for that title? Can't wait. It's going to be exciting. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, Lee. What are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, four goals in his last three games. He's in superb form. He's going to be really hard to stop. The defenders need to be on their game. The ball with Waldschmidt. And do they mean business on this occasion? Well, an effort he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he should be doing better than that. He had options around him too. He chose the wrong one. figuring prominently on the back pages in the last few days. The reports have been confirmed. He's decided to end what has been a brilliant career at the end of this season. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And the referee has determined that that is a bookable offence. I don't think you can think anything else after that challenge. Well, certainly he looks surprised that's a yellow. And he whips it in. Suarez. Otavio now. Tremendous block. And he's fired over the corner. Not really the ideal clearance. Moving forward effectively. A case of foiling the opposition by whatever means. Relentless high pressing. He must finish! And that's a fine stop. With the game level, let's see what they can do with this corner. They've decided to take the corner short. 
Well, the cross came over and a real rifle against the post, but back in play. Ferro. Sergio Oliveira. So for Benfica, not the best of experiences last time out when they lost against Belenenge. What do you expect today, Lee? Well, losing by a narrow margin is frustrating, but at home... Well, every finisher's dream, and this time it's in! Well, the goal will not stand. It is offside. Yeah, good football there, but just straight offside. with Rafa Gabriel gliding through the gears well, he failed to get it away properly Otavio now well that's one for them to pursue Suarez and the referee has pointed to the spot a penalty it is and a chance for them to forge ahead Well, more drama here. The referee has pointed to the spot while showing a red card. as well well he delicately poised this game has this incident tipped the balance and that is when you need your goalkeeper it is to be a throw in Technique displayed. Wonderful chance. Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out the net. Absolutely amazing. Going short. And it's played into the centre. Well, nothing wrong with the header, but it was always going that little bit off target. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. And here's Kappa. It's with Zé Luis. Suarez. Oliveira. Suarez. Extremely sloppy in possession. That is that for the first half here. And a chance for them to nudge in front. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Crisp tackling. A 
but he was in the right place to intercept. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, no goals for him, no real chances either. He needs to help his team a little bit more just to get involved in the game. I think he would be the difference. It has to be! Absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. They favoured a short one here. And the cross comes to nothing in the end. The ball with Otavio. A very big transfer news to pass on. Yozua Kimi has completed his move to Barcelona League. A reported fee of around £80 million. Pounds. Huge amount of money. Responsibility on a player's shoulders with that sort of price tag is huge. But he's a huge player. Big personality. Given away by Benfica. And Suarez with it. Is it going to be? Oh, right in the nick of time. And he's broken free. Goalkeeping of the very highest order. Oh, it was a great shot as well. Great shot, great save. Corner, kick played over. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. And that's an important intervention. Tremendous intuition to win it back. to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that they've won back possession well it's come down to the final 20 minutes here Vinicius and the emphasis is on creativity has a go tremendous block he's got to score we wondered if a goal was forthcoming but it has arrived now well, finally, the deadlock has been broken. Not long to go now. How will that affect the opposition? Well, they've taken a lot of pressure down to 10 men, but they've dug in. They really have tried to get back into this game and how they've done that. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. One nil then. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Benfica really struggling in terms of possession, but again, we've seen it before, we'll see it. And it's a quality pass. Well, now in a dangerous position. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Well, Derek, the clock is ticking, the crowd are doing their bit, trying to get the players forward to try and get this goal. They've given it away. Well, they haven't been at their best today, that's for sure, but this game is far from over, and the fans are certainly reminding them of that. You've got to think there'll be one more chance or two. Given away by Benfica. Now they're on the scent of something positive. Good tackle. Vinicius. And no wonder he's enjoying himself.
Well, sometimes it's really hard to play against 10 men, and this lot are finding it hard. They're losing this game now, and you have to give credit. 10 men are now winning this game. So, 2-0 now. And that was a very fine read. As indicated, there will be a minimum. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And he takes on the shot. The crossbar cuts in the way. That's it. The referee brings the action to an end. Positive after positively. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp. Constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful. Have you got time for just a few questions? Thank you so much for your time.